It's meaty. It's packed with tons of flavor. It's a seafood salad, y'all. Let me show you how easy it is to make a delicious seafood salad. What is poppin' uh, my YouTube family? Um, today I have to taste for some fried fish. So I wanted to pair it with a nice, light, delicious seafood salad. So I just scraped up some things I found in my refrigerator and we about to make it happen. So of course we are starting with, this is good, really quick y'all, really quick, easy uh, seafood salad my way. And we are of course starting with some elbow noodles that I already went ahead and boiled this is like I think three three stalks of um, celery that I put in my processor because I like my center celery really fine in my salads in my cold salads I don't like to bite into big chunks of celery um, and I also have a medium white onion here that I also put in the processor so one thing that I wish I had for this recipe is mayo not miracle whip so we are working with miracle whip but we gonna make it do what it do we gonna make it it's gonna be okay it's gonna be okay so let's start off with like three heaping spoonfuls and see if that's gonna be enough and I'm gonna mix this up and then we're gonna get into adding in some seasonings y'all and we gonna take this salad up a couple of notches Hope everybody is doing spectacular today. Thank you all for tuning in and watching my video. I appreciate it more than you would ever know. If you are not subscribed, what are you waiting for? Come on, hop on the wave. Hit the subscribe button for me. I would really appreciate it. And don't forget to turn on that post notification bell so you can get notified each and every time Yas Yas Catering uploads a recipe or two or three or four. So we have this nice and incorporated. Let's get those at the bottom trying to hide on us. Real quick, real simple. How do you guys make your uh, pasta salads or your seafood salads? Or what do you like to eat with a nice piece of uh, fried fish? Do you, are you just like french fries? Do you like a cold salad with it? I'm doing both because I'm greedy like that. I want a nice cold salad and I want some good french fries. It's going to be on and popping. So I think we have this mixed up nice and well. Okay, so now let's start adding in our meat. So I have over here some already cooked um, shrimp. And we are just going to pop the tail off these bad boys and get the pop of them in. I should have did this off camera, y'all. I'll be back. Let me pop these tails, y'all, and I'll be right back. Okay, my beautiful YouTube fam, I am back. So I have my little already, um, you know, these come fully cooked. So I popped the uh, tail off of all of these. And what I'm also going to add in my salad today is some salmon. I have some leftover salmon that I'm definitely not going to throw out. So what we're going to do is just take our fingers and we're just going to kind of crumble that, that salmon right up in there. Crumble it right up. It's going to be refreshing and delicious, y'all. Trust me. Crumble it up. I know a lot of people like to use like crab meat. You can definitely do that if you have it on hand. Um, basically, I'm using what I got to get what I want, but I have done this salad before. Salmon is actually, actually very good to use. The salmon and the shrimp goes really good together. So I think, make it as meaty as you want. Okay. So let's give this a stir and see, what's, see what it's hitting for. Let's see what it's hitting for. We definitely go add some more mayo. I can see that right now. So just give it a nice good stir. 
Mm, 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 mm. This is going to be good. And I like my salad. That's why I'm making this like way ahead of time. Because I like my salad um, chilled. I know like my fiance, he likes his salads like warm or like room temp. I do not like that. So, okay. Let me grab another spoon, y'all, to put some more mayo in here. Add some more Miracle Whip. And the Miracle Whip is sweet. That's why for like cold salads, I like to really use um, uh, mayo. Because the Miracle Whip is jive sweet, but with the seasonings that we're going to use, um, it's going to dump down that sweetness. Let me wash my hands real quick. Where's my glove on? Okay, so I think this is as meaty as I want it. So now what I'm going to do is start getting into these seasonings. What we are going to do is add um, a little bit of apple cider vinegar. Okay. I wish I could give y'all exact measurements. Um, that's probably two t about two, two tablespoons that I just used. We are also going to add a few splashes of lemon juice. Not a lot. That was about a tablespoon. Um, we are also going to add some yellow mustard. Yellow mustard by Al. We are also going to add a little smidge of sweet relish. Just that much. We are going to add some garlic pepper seasoning. Not a lot, because these salads take on seasoning real good and it, it will get salty quick, y'all. I'm also going to add some lemon pepper seasoning. Just like that. And if we need more seasoning, we'll just double back and add some more. And I'm also going to add some Old Bay. That's going to give it a little twang, a little heat, a little bit like that. And I'm also going to add in some Salad Supreme. Build up your flavors. Salad Supreme. Okay. And we are also going to add in some parsley to make your salad nice and pretty. Dry parsley doesn't really give things flavor. It's the uh, fresh parsley that does. This is just to make it look really cute. Okay, let's give it a twirl. Oh, this is looking good already. Look at that shrimp. Ooh. Now what I usually, but I just didn't feel like cooking it, y'all. Um, sometimes what I like to add in my macaroni salad or my seafood salad is I'll fry some bacon. And I will uh, crumble up some bacon and throw that right in the salad and toss it. It's so good. It is like so good. Okay. Make sure you get that bottom. You want everybody to join the party. Join the flavor party. You know what I mean? I don't add egg to mine. You know, if you want to add egg, do you? Scallions. You know, you could have used... Um, Onion and scallion, or just scallion if you want. Okay. That's looking great. So let's give it a little taste to see where our seasonings are. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. And see that onion, y'all? That onion and that uh, couple of splashes of apple cider vinegar is cutting the sweetness of the uh, Miracle Whip. So it's like, mmm. Bomb. Quick, simple, easy, flavorful seafood salad. Let me give it one more taste with some of the meat. Mm. 
Mm. Yeah. The only thing I would add, let me add this. Is what is missing is some um, black pepper. And the black pepper is also gonna cut that. Because I like to see pepper in my food. So I'm gonna be a little heavy on the pepper. And also, lastly but not least, I am throwing in some fresh diced. Um, this is one tomato that I diced up. One fresh tomato. And that's just going to add to the freshness. And mm, mm, mm. So y'all, so what I'm about to do is just get this nice and stirred up. And I will be back to show you guys the uh, plated up salad. And also my fish after I fry it and also what I'm going to pair it with. So be back guys. Here you go guys. Here's the star of the show. Paired it with some french fries, some nice fried fish, homemade tartar sauce. As always, thank you guys for tuning in. Everybody stay safe and stay blessed.